Rogers County deputies arrest two Wisconsin men accused of driving through the state with 2,000 vacuum sealed THC vapes. Deputies say the men were smuggling the marijuana vapes from California to the Chicago area. News on 6's Reagan Ledbetter has more on the investigation. Deputies tell me while it's not fentanyl, meth, or heroin, it's still drugs, and it's dangerous and illegal to smuggle drugs in or out of Oklahoma. Rogers County deputies say a traffic stop led to them finding 2,000 THC vapes in the trunk of a car driven by Guillermo Nuno and Giovanni Rivera. They were pretty intent on covering the odor. Each package was wrapped in two to three layers of vacuum sealed bags. Sergeant Ron Walker works interdiction for the sheriff's office and is specially trained to look for indicators of criminal activity during traffic stops. He says when he pulled over Nuno and Rivera, they showed all the signs and says he could smell marijuana in the car. As if rehearsed, he quickly told me, we flew to California, we took a rental car coming home because we had to go to Houston, Texas to visit family. And that's why we were traveling the way we are. Walker says one suspect told him they drove because airfare was too expensive. But Walker noticed their rental car bill was $1,000, not including gas. And when I asked the driver about that versus airfares, he just slumped down in his seat, looked completely defeated. Walker says while some may think smuggling THC vapes isn't dangerous, he says it is and that kind of criminal activity is often tied to other crimes, even violent crimes. The regulations we have are to try to protect people. Unknown items made with unknown products from somewhere else. There's no guaranteed way to make sure it's safe for citizens. In Rogers County, Reagan Ledbetter, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.